Hi students, this is Ramya from Pharma Tours and today I am going to explain about the Michael addition. It is an addition reaction between Michael donor with Michael acceptor in presence of base to form a Michael adduct. Adduct means addition product which will give rise to CC single bond. So first of all what is Michael donor and what is Michael acceptor we will see. Michael donor means the compound which is having active methylene group. What is active methylene group? Active methylene compound or those which is having active methylene group. Active methylene group means CH2 group. Methylene group which is attached to two electron withdrawing groups. So what this electron withdrawing groups will do? So, this will increase the acidity of this hydrogen. So, presence of this electron withdrawing group will increase the acidity of this hydrogen. So, active methylene compounds are those which are having acidic hydrogens. Which can provide acidic hydrogen. Acidic means which can easily donate the hydrogens. So these are active methylene compounds. Example, we can give the electron withdrawing groups such as carboxylic acid, carboxylic ester, cyanide group, nitro group, etc. So these are electron withdrawing groups. The presence of these group will increase the acidity of these hydrogens. So active methylene compound is that which is having acidic hydrogens. So now which is called as a Michael donor which can provide acidic hydrogens. Next acceptor. Michael acceptor is a alpha beta unsaturated carbonyl compound such as aldehyde, ketone, ester, amide. So carbonyl compounds example it can be ketone, aldehyde, ester or amide. So which is having uh, this is alpha carbon and next to this beta carbon so it should have alpha beta unsaturated bond so this is alpha carbon and this is beta carbon so carbonyl compound which is having alpha beta unsaturated group these compounds are called as michael acceptor so it is addition reaction between michael donor and the michael acceptor to form a adduct that is addition product addition product finally has c double single bond c adduct means addition product so this is uh, michael addition so now let's explain with some example in this example, uh, malonic ester acts as a donor which has uh, active methylene group CH2 group attached to carboxylic ester groups. These are two electron withdrawing groups and uh, alpha beta unsaturated ketone. So this is uh, alpha carbon and this is uh, beta carbon. So alpha beta unsaturated ketone acts as a uh, acceptor. So, it is a reaction between Michael donor and acceptor in presence of base to give a addict. So, how to write a addition product? So, I will just show you a simple trick. So, here we have a uh, active methylene compound. So, in this uh, methylene group, hydrogen will go to give rise to nucleophile. So, here we have a nucleophile and hydrogen. So, nucleophile will attach to the beta carbon and hydrogen will attach to the alpha carbon so hydrogen will attach to the alpha carbon and the nucleophile will attach to the beta carbon so if i will get a product so let's see how to write see this uh, ester c r o c double bond o c h c double bond o r see here the nucleophile it is attached to the beta carbon that is uh, CH2 so here always remember alkene is a site of addition reaction so CH2 when addition occurs the double bond becomes single bond then CH was there here then here hydrogen is added so CH2 C double bond OR 
so this is a addition product or michael addict when obtained when michael donor and accept or undergo addition reaction in presence of a base so now let's see the mechanism involved in the michael addition reaction so always the first step always it is a formation of a carbonyl or nucleophile formation of a carbonyl or nucleophile so how it is formed so when the active methylene compound uh, that is a melonic ester melonic ester when it uh, in the presence of a base so base what it will do it will abstract the hydrogen so which hydrogen it will abstract it will abstract the hydrogens which is attached to the methylene group so methylene group so and it will uh, give rise to carbonyl c o so yes ch e we have carbonyl c o o r so this is carbonyl obtained when melonic ester undergo in presence of base hydrogen is abstracted to give a carbonyl so this is the first step involved in the uh, michael addition and the next step is attack of carbonyl or nucleophile it can be nucleophile so attack of nucleophile or carbonyl on alpha beta unsaturated compound so which is alpha beta unsaturated compound here it is michael acceptor um, alpha beta unsaturated ketone so let's see how it will attack so nucleophile where it will attack it will attack uh, beta carbon so this is alpha carbon and this is beta carbon see the moment what will happen see now this uh, anion when it attacks the beta carbon see the moment of electrons bonds here so here we'll get the minus charge see when we uh, when it attacks so we got uh, co ch uh, c double bond or and this beta carbon will go and attack here ch2 and here this bond mode here double bond c and here o minus so we got alkoxide derivative here so we got uh, alkoxide derivative so this is the second step involved and uh, uh, you can see uh, here this is the first carbon atom and this is second carbon atom this is third atom and this is the fourth atom so just remember this and the next step is protonation so in the protonation step the alkoxide derivative which is obtained the alkoxide this is alkoxide derivative which is protonated from the conjugate acid this is conjugate acid that base as a accepted proton so protonated base is conjugate acid so alkoxide derivative accepts proton so where it will attack it will attack oxygen so now we got uh, ro c double bond o c h c double bond o r c h 2 c h double bond c o h so what we got here the alcohol so we got alcohol but carefully observe this structure so this is the nucleophilic part and this is alpha beta unsaturated ketone which was converted to alcohol you can see the oh alcohol is there and also double bond is there so it is this is ene that is um, alkene and this is alcohol so this is called as enol so which is having both uh, unsaturated bond ene alkene plus alcohol group so this is called as enol the compound formed here is enol and you can see that this is nucleophile it is attached to the beta carbon this is alpha carbon and this is beta carbon so this is one two three and four so here you can see the proton is 
added to fourth atom and the nucleophile is added to first carbon atom and it is called as 1,4 addition product. What is called as this is 1,4 addition product. Why it is called 1,4 addition product? Because the addition occurs at one first carbon and the fourth atom that is oxygen. So what we got here? Enol. So and we know that when enol is there, it will undergo tautomerism to keto form. So how it will undergo tautomerism? So let's see here the we have uh, hydrogen. So that is enol. So when it is uh, having see this hydrogen, it will go off and it will attack this atom carbon atom. So when this hydrogen will go off and it will attack this carbon atom. Now we will see how it will attack. See this keto. So when this is goes, goes off and you will get uh, and here the electrons will move. So we, you got C double bond O and this hydrogen it will attack. Here it is deficiency. See this is deficient in electron and it will attack this carbon atom so now we got uh, see this will undergo tautomerism to keto form that is roc double bond o ch c double bond or ch2 ch see this bond mode here so c double bond o r and this hydrogen is attacking this carbon so here CH2 now you see so this is nucleophile and this is first carbon second third and fourth now the proton is added to second carbon and the nucleophile is added to first carbon and it is called as 1 2 addition product 1 2 addition product and this is enol form and this uh, it will undergo tautomerism to keto form so it will undergo keto enol tautomerism tautomerism means it is a dynamic equilibrium between keto form and the enol form when keto form is there it will get converted to enol and enol form is there it will get converted to ketol so by one four addition product that is enol undergo tautomerism to keto product so by michael addition we will finally we will get one two addition product so this is about michael addition thanks for watching the video please subscribe the channel for more videos